Man, big shout out to Pastor Haynes, man. This pastor's anniversary was really dope, man. Had Stephanie Mills to perform. It was a lot of fun, man. Shout out uh, uh, to my cousin Pat for hanging out with me, man. We had a real good time. Uh, Friendship West Missionary Baptist Church, Dallas, Texas. Good to see everybody. Casey, all of y'all, man. That was a whole lot of fun. Y'all, you missed a performance of a lifetime, bro. Yo, hopefully they do it next year, man. I got to come check it out, man. Absolutely. Good morning. Who is this? This somebody who feelings is really hurt right now. That's why it not work. This somebody who ain't coming to work, who don't ever come to work, who call no, in sick no, every day. No, this, this, hey, look, 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 uh, this somebody who who is a real man, but my feelings is really hurt right now. No, no, I say they're not coming up and, uh, and, and uh, say, I know what. Uh, I, uh, say, you know, sometimes when, when your coworker treats you like, like you, you like what? Like you like what? Like like you not like you not good enough. Well, good enough because you ain't here. I mean, they don't treat you bad. I mean, you're not experiencing that ain't, that ain't anything. The part. You you have to come here to experience bad. That ain't the part. The part is one of your favorite people in the world did me wrong. Okay. And he need to and he need to apologize. That's why I ain't come to morning because I ain't want to get emotional. Wait a minute, what? Gary, yep. Gary with the T. I want, I wanted to go to his thing last night where he got, we get, we he got his award, right? And then he didn't give me, he pulled got me an invitation. What happened, Gary? Well, he wasn't coming no damn well with me. <laughs> I'm trying to be supportive. I'm trying to be supportive, be a good coworker. Yeah, you know, why you wouldn't let Black Tony go nowhere with you? Because first of all, it was a a, a formal event, and um, Black Tony. Black Tony, what you have... had on? What mm. you had on, Black Tony? <laughs> he had what on, you had on gold though? teeth on. That's what he had. Ain't nobody had gold teeth on last night. I had a clean white t-shirt, <laughs> <laughs> a camouflage shorts, and some brand new Air Force ones. He can't wear that to that. No. And a chain, and a chain what I had got from the mall. <laughs> and how many goals you, you had on the whole gold grill or just what? I had on the top and bottom grill. Your what? My top and bottom grill. <laughs> and how was your hair? Had you been smoking? Did you smell like weed? I mean, I mean, I sprayed on, I sprayed on some blunt spray so I wouldn't smell like weed. Gary, why you leaving my side, man? First of all, Ricky, honey, I... He just described the way he was looking, honey. Gold teeth were not part of the uh, look last night, number one. And I wouldn't take it no damn well because he owed me fifty dollars here from a couple of years ago. So no, sir. Let's tell him where you uh, where you suit at. You don't have a suit. <gasps> yeah, I ain't got no damn suit. I ain't got no damn suit. Hmm. I asked Gary because I wear one of his suit. So you're not coming to work today because your feelings hurt because of what Gary did to you last night. Yo, because I want to call so I can talk about it, so I can come on the radio and talk about how much fun we had. <laughs> Somehow I feel like, like we being I'm manipulated. Go well, I don't ever get invited nowhere tonight. Rick, if you say something, I'm not going to lie. If you just seen some of the pictures from the girls last night that was their baby, them girls have been clutching their pearls, honey. Mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>